Okay, let's start again. Okay, ready. Take. What we're doing here this morning is we're doing a report and a test on Jewel 25 dry adhesive film that has been supplied to a customer who's having difficulty applying it onto the windows. So we're doing our own test to ensure and see whether in fact there is a problem with this film or not. Yesterday we took this film and it was installed on this window over here and when I look at it it looks fine to me I don't see any problems any issues with it it looks very clear to me and from the outside it's got a nice reflective surface so as far as I'm concerned it's a hundred percent however what might be happening on site is is a lack of experience when it comes to installations of various types of film there are various types of films. There's PS films with a sticky adhesive. And then there's dry adhesive film, which is specially designed for flat glass and easy installation and longer longevity as far as the long lasting of the film is concerned. This film that we're going to be installing on this other window is the same as the film we have on this window. It's the Jewel 25 film. And we're going to demonstrate how you're supposed to install this film properly. And it's going to be done by Job, one of our uh, chief installers in this company. And he's going to actually take you through the procedure. Uh, from my discussion with Job, when installing this type of film, one needs a lot of water. And also it needs to be squeegeed very well to get all the moisture out from the back of the water and to smooth out all the adhesion. So what we're going to take you on to now is the actual application of the film. The film is coming out of the same box where we cut the film for the customer, you blinds, and we're cutting the film now in the box, from the box. So we're going to move over to this position. Unfortunately, it's not easy to film because we're living in South Africa and at the moment we are experiencing load shedding so in the office at the moment is load shedding so the, the the video might be quite dark but i don't believe it's going to be a problem because the light is coming in from inside and you'll be able to see the application technique and it will also be explained in full detail by job as he is installing the film so i'm going to hand you over to job who is at the moment cutting the film out the box the Jewel 25. Here's job. Okay. Okay, what we're doing now, we're measuring the window to take the size of the window. With the white and the length. Then we're going to cut the filling, the exact size of the window. Job. I've been working here uh, since 2002. I've got a lot of experience when it comes to this uh, type of film. And uh, dry adhesive film is uh, one of a kind. So when you apply it, you need to follow all the procedure. But you need to put a lot of water on it. As you can see that I will be starting to clean up the window which is the most important thing on the application when you apply the filling you must spray too much water and get a, 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 a scar and clean it nicely on all sides of windows top and bottom as you can see Then you take your scraper and put more water and scrape it. Make sure that the window is nicely and clean. And clean it nice, nice. And you need a uh, proper tools to install the, the filling. Oh, wait. Wait. 
can see that from the right. on the edges. Then you spray more water. Cleaning is the most important uh, procedure on the when it comes to install the filling. It's very much important. You take the, the spoon, then you scrape it. Once you finish to scrape it, you spray water again. And you take your rubber squeegee. And when you rubber squeegee, you start from the corner and then you rubber squeegee across with your wet. The rubber squeegee mustn't leave the water behind because that water can leave the dirt inside. So you rubber squeegee it nicely. Going down, so you mustn't leave water behind because the water can make the filling that dead inside. So you can lift it down, down. And when you're done, what you need to do, you take the the cloth or a paper towel. Then you clean your edges. You clean your edges nicely. On all corners. And when you're satisfied that the cleaning procedure is done, then you spray water. You rubber squeeze again. As you know that the trimming is the most important part of the of the job. More than keeping the trimming is very important. And you see it. Then comes the part of the application. Firstly, you put water on the glass. And when you put water, make sure that the water doesn't go through the rubber on the corners. Because if the water goes inside, it can uh, bring the dirt from inside the rubber into the field. And then you spray your water from top going down. So you can't start bottom going up. And you spray water. You spray too much water when applying a uh, dry adhesive filling. Make sure that you got too much water. Okay. Okay. Whenever you're ready. Now we're gonna put the film on the glass. So as you can see how I hold the glass the you need to hold it up tight so it must be squeezy. So it must be up tight. And you spray water. You put too much water as much as you can. Because if you leave part of the film that is that is no water, it's gonna give you a problem. You make sure that part, all the things is for too much water. Okay. Then we're gonna apply it. If you wanna make sure that all the, all the side, that the thing is not gonna give you trouble, you take the side of the manufacturer, then you put it straight on the other side.
Okay, then you put it straight up into the rubber. And you straight up. And you can take it, keep it up there on top. Then once you satisfy the, the all the corners are, are nicely done, you spray water on the filling. You hold it the corner so the filling must be good. And then you take your squeegee, you start on the top, squeeze the side, and squeeze the side, then you start to squeeze. When you squeeze it, you mustn't squeeze it to the end because if you squeeze it to the end before you cut the filling, the dirt will come inside. So you push the water halfway. Just to make sure that the filling is nicely tight on the window. On the window. Dry adhesive, you must put too much water. A lot of squeezing. That's what is important when it comes to dry adhesive. Okay, you done with the squeezy, and then you spray water, and then you can take something like a guide to put on the side when trimming. When trimming, you put the, a guide on the side. If you're not sure about your steady hand, and then you use that guide to cut. Then you cut two to the bottom. not well cut to cut it again then you take that piece off you go on top you cut the little piece that is on there finger to hold the, the edges of the corner and you spray water and you take a squeeze again then you squeeze that water that you squeeze it halfway inside in that case the water has got a space to go outside out Squeeze it hard. And you squeeze the top. Not yet. And you squeeze the water out. At the bottom, you use a guide if you're not sure about your steady hand. Because a guide is the 
it's not gonna make me mistake. We spray water again to put back the baking sheet. As I was squeezing with a softer squeegee, just to take the water out. We put too much water on the filling. Then you take the baking sheet. The purpose of the baking sheet is to Back up the filling so your squeegee machine scratch the, the filling. Then you put it on. You put it on nicely. You stretch it on all the corner to make sure that the baking sheet is nicely sit. Then you put water on top of the baking sheet. So your squeegee is gonna squeeze it nicely smoothly. Then you use a type of a hard squeegee to squeeze all the water using power. All the ends to squeeze it out. Then squeeze it left and right. But you must squeeze it harder. Dry this feeling you need to squeeze it more harder than any other feelings. Because it's using water too much. left and right you can use both hands Let me give you this. 
sound properly. Yes. With all the sound. And when you, you come to the bottom, way, uh, you can the change the style here. of squeezing the and you squeeze it to the bottom. Yeah, okay, cool. And then what is the price on the silver? It's 238 grand per square meter cup to size. So is the style of squeezing you squeeze it to the bottom. And when you're done, you can take, if you're not sure, you're not happy with, satisfied with the squeezing, you can take a slammer, more powerful than the other squeezing, that you can grip nicely, and then you start to squeeze with it. Squeezing is most important because you need to squeeze all the water out. Make sure that all the water out. Also, you can grip it with two water, two hands. Welcome to the bottom, we use the same style again. Go down. Check where the film is peeling or bubbling. You check the corners. Okay, you got everything you need too. Okay. Then you cut that piece off. Then you flatten it up. Two thirty-eight. Go to the other corner. Okay. Cut the corner off to flatten it. Then you check on the side. If the film is not right, you cut it. You cut it to the bottom. Then you check the corner. Up. And when you're done, you take it this rough, you round it uh, on the squeegee. Then you take your squeegee to squeeze the water on the edges. Then the, the cloth is sucking the water from the, the rubber. You squeeze it down. 
or you can use a, a blue paper towel then you go on to the top again doing the same thing side also the bottom then the window is done then you have to go outside and check if you see any fault with it is nicely done in on the corner all the water is pissed out so you have to check and if there's bubbles like this on the corner on top go back inside and there's water in the middle if there's a bit of water like this mark you go inside to see Then you take your squeeze again. You put a, a cloth around it. Then you push it. Even in the middle, you can push the water out. And you can it from the outside. Oh, it's nice. And you can cut the, 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 the bubbles if there's a little bit of bubbles. And you can put a guide again on the side. And the window is done nicely.